You are somewhat familiar with Toronto. You were here for a little bit uh, way back when, 17 games. You, you move on. You have a, a wonderful career elsewhere. Now you're back full circle. Um, how has it been the first couple of weeks for you? It's been great. Uh, I say it's changed so much. It's so different from back in back in 06 when I first was here. Um, but it's been wonderful. The team has uh, changed so much. Uh, the organization is, is, is uh, it's taking another, so many steps forward. Um it's unbelievable, the fans, everything. So just to be back uh, and get that feel of, of Toronto, New Toronto, is, is pretty awesome. You know, it's it's funny because we watch this team and, and, you know, a couple of tough losses before this one, and we see you come in and, and we know what you bring. We see Serge Ibaka come in. We know what he brings. And then at the same time, you know, Kyle Lowry goes down but before the All-Star break. So, you know, here watching this team the last four years, I think the fan base gets – frustrated because you say well what if what if that guy was back and for a guy like you that comes in well I mean you don't know you, you haven't played in the same court as 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 Kyle Lowry here since you got here is that a little bit of an unknown for you even yeah a little bit um but I, I've known Kyle for, for years we've known each other since college uh I know I play so it's one of those things that I don't even you know it, it's, it's uncertainty but I know for sure what he's gonna bring uh, the guy's so tough, and he brings so much uh, energy and toughness to the team that, uh, you know, just that energy of having him back would be awesome. Um, me and Serge still finding our way with the team, still figuring it out uh, without him in his absence. Uh, and lately, DeMar been out as well. So we're just trying to just, just, just tack on wins and play together and just make it work until he gets back. P.J. Tucker, our guest on the Andrew Walker Show, Sportsnet 590, The Fan. Um, the Raptors take on the Oklahoma City Thunder on Thursday. So you spend time over there. You come back here, as mentioned, 17 games with the Raptors in 06. So you come back, you play a full year in Phoenix, and it was really the next year, 2013, 2014. That's kind of when Raptors basketball took off here, and it coincided with with Kyle and, and DeMar. Now, from somebody that, that had known this market a little bit before, now, you are playing in, in Phoenix. You watch uh, the Raptors finally make it back to the postseason and, and and the success they've had since. You know, from an outside perspective, what, what did you always think of this resurgent brand of, of Raptors basketball? What's, what's the, uh, I guess, around the league, what's the, uh, what's the MO here? Man, for me, uh, just watching, it was always, uh, you know, these guys, they just look like every year they're getting better. Like every year they're taking another step forward to being able to be in the championship conversation, always at the top two, I mean, top two or three in the East the last few years. I mean, they're just chipping away and getting better and better. So I think around the league is, is known that these guys every night come out and play. You know, they're one of the best teams at home. Uh, and it's tough to beat at home. But I think it was just the energy and the swagger they play with uh, that kind of uh, it makes it appealing and it makes, makes them have their own little edge. So what's the identity right now? I mean, what are you seeing from this team? We all know the offense relies so much on on Kyle to facilitate. Um, but right now, I mean, when you win, when you play um, well, it's it's kind of based on, on defense right now, isn't it? Yeah, I think uh, when you watch the games, I think since we and Serge have been here, when we locked in and played really well on defense, and we won. We started getting out on the break. Uh, you know, we started we start to move the ball better. We started to... Uh, you know, uh, I, I think as a team, as a unit, it comes together better when we play defense. And I, I know most teams, it's kind of cliche you can say that about most teams, but I think since we've been here in a few, few games that we've been here, that's definitely been the case. 